Did you ever got the message from Facebook your ad is disapproved like this? Your ad was rejected because it does not comply with your advertisement policies? Or you are running a Facebook ad promoting an affiliate offer and suddenly your ad account shut down? If yes, this video is for you. In this video guys, I am going to show you some of the ad policies which is really important for every affiliate marketer. I am going to explain to you Facebook ad policies for affiliate marketing. Step by step, I am going to pick some of those important Facebook ad policies which is really really important to keep in mind while running Facebook ad promoting affiliate offer. Hello everybody, my name is Raj and welcome to Affiliate Conversion. If you are first time here, do subscribe my channel for make money online or affiliate marketing business model where I am uploading videos on Monday and Thursday. Smash that like button right away right now guys because Facebook ad is really very important if you are an affiliate marketer because it will scale your business fast as compared to any other method or strategy which you are using in affiliate marketing. So with that said guys, let's dive in. So before I explain you Facebook ad policies for affiliate marketing, I want to share you two very important things. The number one, all of these Facebook ad policies are really really important. Okay, all of these things you have to spend little time to learn right going inside of all these things and reading about this. Okay, so if you want to run Facebook ad promoting affiliate offer, okay, without disable and disapproval. And then guys, the number two very important thing is what I'm going to share you here. Okay, the major important thing for affiliate marketing that is with my experience running Facebook ad promoting affiliate offer from past five years. Okay, so it can vary. So if you are new, you have to spend in all. Okay, but there are four major one guys, which is really, really important while running Facebook ad for any affiliate marketing. And that is guys, prohibited content, restricted content, positioning and text in ad images. So let's go one by one because all of this have almost like right 20 to 30 policies under of this. Okay, for example, prohibited content. Under this guys, all of these things are really, really important. Few of them is really important is like this one, right? Tool one. Make a checklist guys. So next time when you run an ad, just you have to make sure that everything is fine. Okay. You are complying with Facebook ad policies. Okay. If you click here, personal attributes, your ad should not focus about a person, race, ethic, origin, religious, belief, age, sexual orientation or practice. Okay. Gender, identity. Okay, disability, medical condition. While writing your copy, call to action, images should not have all these things, guys. For example, here you can see ad creative that describe or shows the promoted product or service. It's fine. Okay, but using the word others to reference personal characteristics are not allowed. Okay, all these things you can read. And one of the major mistake which you're gonna see is this one: calling out the audience. Okay. For example, are you a Christian? Meet other Buddhist. Okay, meet other seniors. Not allowed by the Facebook ad, guys. You can use other ways, okay, but you can't use all these kinds of calling out or something, some line, some right uh, text in your ad images or call to action to hurt anybody's right sentiments or calling out or misleading. Okay, after two, the very important one is the fifteenth one. That is non-functional landing pages. So guys, they want your landing page, right, which you are using as a bridge page between the affiliate offer should work right properly like error pages or site that under construction they don't like it okay landing page that does not match the product and service okay that it should have a relevancy guys whatever you're promoting so this is again a very very important thing okay this too so that your landing page should have proper functioning that is that means guys you have to test your landing page before you run facebook ad test all the links are working all the image whether the landing page is opening or not all this you have to check this thing okay the after tool and 15 the another one is guys the 19th one okay that is personal hat a creative images which you are using okay they want non zoom figure right where you are showing everything and the very important thing which mistake you do is right, this images okay before and after images okay before she was th like this and after taking this product right she became like this facebook don't want your showing like this instead of this you can show like this okay having some green juice right holding in the hand if you're promoting some weight loss offer so after 12 15 and 19 another very important thing is guys 23 now this is one of the biggest reason your ad got disapproved okay make sure your ad copy images as well as call to action you should avoid all the misleading claims right like guys claims of unrealistic results with specific time 
frames okay so generally when you promote a manifestation offer you call like manifest within 24 hours and if you promote any weight loss product you will say that lose weight within 24 hours on a week or or you would say like make money online with affiliate marketing or weight money online right within a month right ten thousand dollars within a year or something like that right when you claim like this guys hundred dollar in a day if you use those kinds of claims facebook called as a misleading claims even if your product vendor or the product is claiming that you should not use right that's how you have to write a copy any kind of over promise claims tips or tricks right you can't write in your copy and you can also run with facebook ad okay if you're promoting any affiliate offer so make sure that and then you have the another policy that is 24 low quality or disruptive content so here you have to make sure guys your landing page and the sales page should have the relevancy okay that is really very important here you're promoting the same thing your, your landing page is talking about the same thing which you're promoting in your sales page okay and another very important thing is guys do not crop your images do not cut your images it will lose the resolution you have to use the images which is high definition i already have a video on that how to use and what kind of image you have to use right so you can watch this video which is popping up right now in the window okay after this video and then also one of the very important thing guys your sales page should not have pop-up ads as well as guys autoplay let me show you that so here you can see right uh, this is one of the offer of uh, clickbank right scared sound healing system uh, converting very very well right right now so here if you want to promote this offer they have so many different links here generally what people do right they use this video sales letter okay this because of highest epc but there is a problem with this okay and if you open this in a new page and you can see so this is the sales page guys but that is a problem and if you try to close this page you can see this pop-up okay facebook don't like this kinds of uh, pop-up which you're offering okay they consider that you're right disturbing your audience to see the real content okay so they don't like this content uh, this kinds of pop-up okay so make sure you're using right which is given for facebook okay facebook traffic page okay this is made for facebook okay as well as also your video sales letter or the video which you're giving in your landing page or the sales page should not auto play okay it has to play when the audience want to click play okay it should not be auto play so make sure you're selecting that kind of a thing that's why look at this right video sales like letter no auto play but you have to make sure whether they have any pop-up or not okay that's how you have to select the links okay that is what they are talking about here and also if you use some uh, image which doesn't have any right quality your ad will show like this okay low quality okay look at this this image which i'm running here showing the low quality that means it is not relevant and this is a low quality as well as the disruptive content another important policy is 26th here and that is automatic animation okay this is what i was talking about okay right ad must not contain audio or flash animation that plays automatically without a person's interaction or expand with facebook after someone clicks on the ad okay right people will go to this page the audio should not start automatically the video should not start auto play or any kind of different animation okay they don't like it so this is really important in these right prohibited content okay these are the few things which you can make a checklist after watching this video okay and then you have another one and that is restricted content so under restricted content guys you can promote like dating offers gamblings right pharmacy lotteries and all but there is one thing which is very important for affiliate marketer and that is subscription service so if you click here guys make sure the simple thing is right always use privacy policies in your landing page okay you should very clear about the pricing upsells of the product product price is 17 dollar keep it very clear with your landing page okay 17 dollar as well as the upsells also and then also you have to add the terms and condition okay or uh, in your landing page clearly about the product okay so this is a very important and then guys we have positioning which is the most important whenever any facebook big nurse start running out for with affiliate products okay this face this problem only okay and that is relevancy accuracy and related landing page your ad should be relevant right the text image or the media whatever you're using or the product should be always have relevancy and the accuracy that means whatever you're promo uh, promoting the product and services right be clear 
clear about that thing in your landing page and the related landing pages here if you click right add quality so here one of the important thing is like text in add image so you should know right how much text you have to put that i'm going to cover in within a second but before that the very important thing is withholding information so whenever you write a copy right your ad copy or the primary text telling your audience to click the link okay so that they can know more about the product so while you're writing you should not withhold the information so okay like a secret or making or people forcing people to click to know more you have to give proper information for example add that withhold information in order to entice someone to click a link to understand the full cortex of something okay that means you're giving a little bit about there and you want to know more then click the link if this kind of a thing facebook don't like it you have to be very clear it should not be clickbaity okay that's what they want to keep okay withholding information and once if your ad got disapproved guys facebook is not going to tell you what is the reason unknowingly you will do so many things right which will leads to disapproval and then later if you do repeat those activities they will disable your account also and at the end guys facebook ad policies is text in ad images okay this is really important so if you click here it will take you to this this one and here you can read all about right what is body text add images image text all those things you can learn here right how much text you have to put what quantity is there they have described properly over here they have given all this description here so you can understand which is right for you you can spend little time uh, reading about right how much text you have to put but if you're an affiliate marketer generally if you're promoting manifestation offer or weight loss offer the best image is doesn't have any text or a little text okay only 20 percent all these things they have described over here so guys i have covered everything like prohibited content restricted content positioning and text in ad image you can watch this video once again and you can take down everything in a checklist before you run facebook ad one or two time guys if you keep that check checklist you will get better in this hope you like this video hope you enjoyed and learned this right smash that like button subscribe my channel so that you can get more valuable content like this and if you're running facebook ad first time i will recommend you to watch these two videos this will guide you how to start facebook ad right properly step by step